what up guys I'm your boy Jay Tunes and welcome back to another resource pack spotlight and today we're gonna to be taking a look at Smoothik uh, for 1.7.2 or just for 1.7 uh, we're gonna be taking a look at that before we actually get into the spotlight and taking a look at all the different blocks guys make sure to hit that like button if you want to see more spotlights and also it helps the channel grow and I would really appreciate it and of course all the information for the texture pack and everything is down below all the information is always down there in the description section click on it go down give it a try but let's go ahead and get right into this and see what it's all about and I hit the wrong key I promise I did there it is there it is all right guys so let's go ahead and get started here so we have all of the different building blocks starting off right here we have the bedrock ice cobwebs and the grass blocks the jack uh, jack-o-lanterns the hay the hay uh, mycelium the obsidian we have blocks of coal stone cobble and gravel which look pretty similar except for the little brown yeah you guys see that there we got the sponge down here we got the dirt uh what did i miss here sand and nether rack right that's all the different building blocks oh and the tnt right there um right over here we have all the different woods with their leaves so we got the dark oak here and the jungle and all that good stuff here so all the different woods here the birch and all that good stuff right here um those are the 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 uh the regular woods down here we have the planks right here and then we have all of the leaves right at top that goes exactly with that uh, with uh whatever wood it is so the dark wood we got the dark wood leaves right there and then we have what the wood looks like from the um from the top side or the bottom side of the actual wood so there we go those are all the different woods right over here we have all the different decorative blocks we have your redstone all your different uh decorative uh stone bricks with the mossy the cracked the stone brick and the chiseled we also have again the redstone all the different quartz that you can get in sandstone right here which look pretty good i like this one right here the chiseled sandstone and also the stone uh, um the chiseled stone brick also looks very good we got mossy stone nether brick uh we have a block of diamond glass and all the snow iron lapis and stone and a block of gold yep that's that's smoothix all decorative blocks right there moving along here guys we have all of the different wools and all the different colors right here okay right here we have all the different clays which i really like the way the clays look to tell you the truth yeah I, I like that i like that a lot so all the different colors and clay uh, stained clay right here and right over here, we have all the different glass, uh, different color stained glass here as well. All the different colors, which look pretty good. Looks pretty good. That They look a bit similar, some of the colors. Um, like the purple and the magenta, the pink and the red. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, they're, they're pretty similar. Uh, but those are all the different colors uh, of glass. Then we have all of the different ores. We got your redstone, your emerald, your lapis, your diamond, your nether, or yeah, nether quartz, your ore, coal, and iron. And then we have your redstone lamp right here and your glowstone. And that's with the redstone lamp on. And that's with it off. On and off. There we go. So those are the redstone lamps. And right over here, we have all the different stairs. You got all your different woods up here. Your different uh, um, stones and stuff right over here. And then we have all the different slabs and all the different uh, with all the different materials from brick and all that good stuff right there. Not too shabby. Right over here, we have the different glass or the glass panes, how they look. And of course, if it was the glass, the colored one, it'd be the exact same thing, just with its color. We have the iron bars. We have the different fences and the nether fence as well. And the gate right over here, we have your cobble wall and your mossy cobble wall, which don't look too bad at all. And right over here are the signs with the text on it right there. Um, that's what it looks like right over here. We have all of the different carpets with all the different colors and the snow right here as well Not too bad right over here We have the enchanting table with the bookshelves and how they look and let's go ahead and place that right over there And you know what I forgot to grab guys. Let me go ahead and do that now. Let me go ahead and just grab a sword um, of any type here let's just go ahead and put that in there and we can go ahead and place something in here so we can go ahead and see what it looks like when you have something in there words are the same and all of the different um, the different textures on this right here alrighty so that's what the enchanting table looks like right over here we have our crafting table and that's what it looks like inside of the crafting table then we have our furnace that is not, you know, no, nothing, it's not working. And then we have the lit up furnace, which looks pretty good. Um, and yeah, and that's what it looks like inside of the furnace as well. And right over here, we have our chest, um, our single chest right here. And if we close it, 
we can see if there's any design there, and there is not. That's what the chest looks like. We got our ender chest right here. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. And then we have the double chest as well. All right, cool. Right over here, we have our cauldron that actually has water inside of it. That's, that's filled right now. And then we have our hopper. And uh, that's from underneath and above the hopper right there. Right over here, we have our brewing stand without any bottles on it, without it working. And this is with bottles on it, and it's all working and good stuff like that. And we can go ahead and check on the inside of that as well. All right, moving along, we have our dispenser right at the top, which looks a bit odd and looks a bit weird, but it still looks good. <laughs> we got a dispenser right there and right underneath that one, we got a dropper that looks about the same. The, the UI looks about the same. Moving along here, guys, we have our command block, and that's what it looks like inside of our command block. And then we have our sticky piston and our regular piston. And that's with them activated and not so activated. Then activated again and then not so activated. So there we go. <laughs> the piston and sticky piston right there. Then we have our redstone torch. We have our comparator and we also have our repeater and some redstone here. And that's with them on activated and not so much. Activated and not. And then you click over here on and off. You know what I'm saying? And then over here and then yeah. There you go. That's with power and without power right there. Moving along over here, guys, we have ourselves the torch. We have the daylight sensor and all the different pressure plates. We got the regular pressure plate, the weighted, uh, the wood pressure plate, and the golden pressure plate. So there we go. And then we have our ladder right here. So that's iron. That's that's the regular one. Wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> we have our ladder right here. And moving over here, we have our uh, switches, we have our buttons and stuff, so wooden button, stone button, and then we have our trapped wire hook as well. And right here, we have the wooden door, the iron door, and the trap doors, and that's what they look like when they're working. So there we go. That was pretty quick. There we go. That's better. Then right over here, guys, we have our note block. Alrighty. I'm making, I'm making some nice beats right now. That's good. That's good. And right here, we have our jukebox. And there we go. Got our little jukebox there. Here we have all the different minecarts. Minecarts, uh, regular minecart. We got the minecart with the hopper, the TNT minecart, the uh, one with the chest, and also one with the furnace. Those are all the different minecarts. And then right here we have all the different rails. We got the regular rail, the activator rail, uh, detector rail, regular rail, and also the uh, powered rail. And that's with that activated right there. That's with the rails activated and not so activated. <laughs> right here, guys, we have the lava, which looks pretty sick. I like the animation on that. That looks pretty good. At least I think so. And right here, we have the water with the boat as well. I like that. I like the clear blue water. Looks real nice. <laughs> right here, guys, we have all the different anvils. The regular anvil, slightly damaged and very damaged anvil. And of course, we have all the different paintings, which I love to look at. Look at that. That looks beautiful. I like them. I like the paintings. This is like my favorite part, to be honest, and that, that's a pretty good one as well. <laughs> we're moving along. We're going. Oh, that one's awesome as well. The Ender, the Enderman face. That is nice. All right, let's keep it going here. And then we have some creeper faces and some slimes and some piggies. Looking pretty, pretty good. I like them. Right over here, guys, we have the item frame. And then we have an item frame with another item frame on the inside. Um, so, yeah, item frame with item frame inside. And then we have all the different heads. Zombie, Wither, Skeleton, Creeper, and the regular head. Those are all the different heads right there. And then we have the bed, which is very important. I think so very important there we go so those are the beds right there and moving over here to all of the greenage we got our sugar cane which looks pretty sick we have our cactus we have our jungle wood with the cocoa beans fully grown we have our melon we have our pumpkin <laughs> we have our uh wheat we have what are these potatoes and we have our carrots right here and right over here we have the nether wart over here, we have all of the different uh, saplings. We have the oak, spruce, and all that good stuff. All of these are the different uh, spruces for the trees. And then we have the dead bush, the fern, the cactus. Then all the different flowers here um, are right here. These are the ones that can be put into a pot, the smaller flowers. And then we have the taller flowers in the back. We got the sunflower and all that good stuff, the roses, uh, the large fern. And then we have the also large double grass, the double grass, the, the tall grass. And then we have regular gr grass right there. And of course, right in the front, we have our uh, shrooms. So we have our mushrooms. Um, 
Let me go ahead and make it daytime here. Give me one second. Uh, there we go. Boom. So there we go. So we have all the different um, vegetation, basically. Oh, and I forgot the lily pad, which is right back here. <laughs> there we go. We got the lily pad right there. And then we have the vines with the beacon. And right inside, we can see the UI for the beacon, which is right there. Let me go ahead and turn that off for you guys. Um, so there we go. That is the UI for the beacon. Not too shabby. Let me go ahead and toss this out as well. Okay, good. Um, and then we have the flames, which are regular flames. Um, yeah, so there we go. That's that. Moving along over to this room here where we have all the wonderful yummy food. We have all the different foods here and not so good foods. We have poisonous potatoes as well and then the spider eyes and stuff like that. But those are all the different foods right there. All the different fish, meat, uh, breads, you know, carrots and all that good stuff. That's what that looks like all right there. And then, of course, we have the full cake here. And then we have the yummy half-eaten cake, which looks pretty... What is that? What kind of cake is that? I don't even know. Is that chocolate? That might be chocolate cake. Can't really tell. That could be something else. Who knows? You know? Who knows? I don't know, but there's a yummy cake. <laughs> right over here, guys, we have all of the other um, materials, all of the, uh, like, loot that you can get off of mobs. Um, and around the world, uh, we have different seeds here. We have leather. We have uh, the uh, uh, the fire, um, the blaze powder and stuff like that all right here. The, the melon and all that good stuff. And the uh, nether star and, and, and slimes, eggs. And all that good stuff there. So all the different loots that you can get around the world um, and throughout the world. And right over here are all the different dyes. Um, every single color is right there. And of course the lapis and uh, the ink uh, sacks, and cocoa beans, and the bone meal. So those are all the different dyes. And right here we have all of the different potions with its splash potion right next to it. Um, as you guys can see right there. And then right here we have an empty bottle and also a bottle with water in it. So there we go. Moving over to this side here. Let's go ahead and start from down here. We have all of the different tools and weapons. The, wool, uh, the, the wooden tools, um, the compass, the clock, and the leads as well um, with the wooden tools there. We have the leather armor, which doesn't look half bad to be honest. It's leather. It's not supposed to look all that fancy. Um, <laughs> we have the iron, or excuse me, the stone tools here uh, with the fishing poles. Uh, the fishing pole with the carrot on it, the arrows, we got the bow, and also the stone sword. And we also have all of the different um, buckets here with, uh, why is that? It's going away. It's going away and it's coming back. Uh, all the different buckets here with uh, water, lava, milk, and the empty bucket as well, right there. And then this is the chain, um, the chain mail armor or chain vest armor. I don't, I don't know. Um, yeah, I think that's what it's called, right? Chain vest? Maybe. Uh, but that's the chain vest armor right there, which I like the eyes on the helmet, which look pretty good. And over here now is the iron tools and, um, weapons. So we have all the different tools there. We got the flint and steel. We have the shears and also we have the sword with the saddles and the, uh, horse iron armor as well. And then we have the iron armor which to be honest uh, i'm thinking this is like my favorite armor right now to be real um these yeah th this one looks better just saying <laughs> but there we go we have the iron stuff right there and then right over here we have all the golden tools and swords uh weapons right there with the uh horse armor as well and saddles of course and then right over here we have the golden armor as well which they all look pretty similar to be honest the gold one doesn't look half bad neither i like the how it's lighter and darker but um yeah, my favorite is still that armor right there. And then moving along to the last bit of armor is or, and tools is the diamond stuff, which is all the diamond tools right there. The diamond sword and the horse armor, the diamond horse armor as well with some more saddles there. And right here, guys, we have a map on an item frame right there. Then here we have all the different records and what they look like. Uh, the, yeah, the music discs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then we have the um, map. Enchanted book, regular book, and the book with the pen. And right over here, we have our doggies. Hello, Mr. Doggy and our little kitties. Oh, I thought they look so cute. They look so cute. All right, let's go ahead and hit this button here, and we can get a wolf. That's what the wolf looks like in the wild, which looks pretty, you know, it looks just like that guy. There we go. We got some wild wolves right there. Right over here, we have the chickens, which... <laughs> Which have some pretty nice looking eyes, yeah? Yeah, 
<laughs> so those are the chickens. Moving right along, guys, we have the villagers, which don't look half bad. They still have the, the, the long nose and stuff looking the same. They have nice hats on and stuff. Let's go ahead and click on them, take a look at the UI in here, and that's what it looks like with the trading and stuff. So that's it right there. And right over here, we have our piggies. Look at them. Look at them. <laughs> I really like the way the pigs look. I like the eyes on the pigs. Actually, to be honest, I think I like the eyes on all of the animals so far, to be real. All right, guys, moving right along over here. We're going to have our onslaughts right there. Look, look at them. Hey, 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 over here. How you doing, buddy? I got, I got your cousins over there. Yep, they're mine. You want to join me? Maybe, maybe not. You can just stay in there. Then we have our cows. Yummy. Give me some beef or some milk. Either one. I like them both. Um, <laughs> I like the pig's eyes better than the cow's eyes, to be honest. But there we go. We got our cows right there. And right over here, we have all the different golems. We have the iron golems, which don't look half bad, to be honest. They don't look half bad at all. And then, of course, we have the snow golems as well. Not too shabby. All right, right over here we have the sheep. Yep, pigs have the best eyes in, in the game so far, or in this resource pack, I should say. Uh, but there we go, we got our sheep right there. And moving right along here, we got our mushrooms. Look at them, look at them. Look at all the mushrooms. There we go, and then over here we have our squid. Look at, look at it go, look at it go. I don't know if it's textured, yep, it is textured, it is, it is, it is. It is. Uh, so those are the squids, and they got the funky eyes. <laughs> and then we have our bats right there, which look about the same, to be honest. They look about the same. So those are the bats right here. We have all, uh, well, not all of them. We have a bunch of different horses here and the different colors that they come in. We have some horses right there. And then we have the horses with the different armors on, the diamond, gold, and iron, and plus the donkey with the, um, the chest on its side or the bags. Um, so there we go. Those are the different horses now that we've gotten through all of the friendly mobs I think it's time to start off with the um, Not so friendly. Well, actually before we do that, let's go ahead and go outside here real quick uh, Before we do that, let's come right over here and take a look at the different trees So we have all the different trees here the oak the uh, birch and the dark wood and all that good stuff So these are all the different trees if you would find them in the world. That's kind of what they would look like um, You know there we go. We have all the different uh, trees right here there we go very nice and let's go ahead and see if there is any change with the actual um, the Sun and the moon so that's noon and it's the same as Minecraft oh, and we're gonna try nighttime now set it to midnight here really quickly and it looks about the same at least to me so there we go so those day and nights in the resource pack let's go ahead and set it back today and let's go ahead and go inside and start taking a look at these hostile mobs because that's what we want to see, right? So we're going to go ahead and get started here. And there is the witch. Hey. Hey. Missy. Look over here. You... <laughs> Let's go ahead and pull out another one. See if they all look the same. Look over here. Hey. Darling. Hey, I'm talking to you. Yeah, there we go. So they do look the same. Yep. No different. Nope. Look over here. I'm look. Oh, my goodness. I'm trying to talk to your friend here. Yep. They look the same. Okay. So those are the witches there. And right over here, we have, uh oh, we have the spiders, which sometimes they get stuck. Well, most times they get stuck. Come on. Come on, just just jump. You can make it. There we go. We got the spiders, which look about the same. I mean, they are textured, but they look about the same there. Yep, there we go. Those are the spiders. Uh, right over here, guys, we have the cave spiders. Let me go ahead and pull out another one because these guys are a bit tiny. Um, come on. There they are. There they are. So there we go. We have our cave spiders right there. And right over here, we have the zombies, our favorite guys in the whole game, right? These guys don't annoy anybody ever. Uh, so there we go. We got the di different zombies. And let's go ahead and pull out a couple of them to see if they're textured. Uh, sometimes, you know, some texture packs have different um, stuff for them. But nope, they all look about the same there. And right over here, we have the slimes. Let me go ahead. Sometimes they do get there. It is. So we got a little guy right there. Hey, friend. Friend, look over here. I'm trying to see your face. Show me your face, please. Come on. Well, it's textured, but it's just hard to see and he doesn't want to he doesn't want to look at me why, why don't you want to come come this way? There we go So we can see the little eyes and nose on these slimes there All right, cool moving right along guys. We have ourselves these skeletons. Hey friend I'm gonna go ahead and pull that out. There it is So those are the skeletons and what they look like. How you doing friend one with armor and without armor? How you doing? See you later you guys have fun in there in prison then we have the silverfish, which 
Oh, they look about the same, to be honest. They look about the same. Let's go ahead and pull out just one more just to see to make sure. Yep, they look about the same. So we have our silverfish right there. And right over here, we have the infamous, ugly, annoying creeper. <laughs> there we go. So it kind of looks like a mummy. There we go. So we got our creepers right there with the red eyes. Oh, I hate these things. All righty. So now that we've seen all of these mobs, right, we need to go ahead and take a look at the nether mob. So starting off with the nether mobs, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the magna, magna cubes, ma magma cubes, right? Magma cubes or, I don't know, lava slimes? I, I don't even know. I think they're mag magma cubes, right? Yeah, something like that. There they go. So those are the magma cubes right there, which look pretty good. Um, yeah, there we go. Magma cubes right over there, and then right here we have the ghast, which are we going to be able to see its face? We kind of can see its face. We kind of can see its face, and if I hit it, it's going to do that nasty scream. You guys know it. Uh, come on. Why can't I hit it? Can I not hit it? Hey, look at me. Look look at me. Oh my goodness. It's not It's not very It's not very nice, this guy. He doesn't, he doesn't like company at all. He's a little shy. We can never see his face. Show me your face, buddy. All right, now that we dealt with that, let's continue moving on. Those are the ghasts, and right over here, it's out of order. Right, right what we have over here, guys, are all of the different spawn eggs, which are exactly the same. Uh, these are all the different um, spawn eggs in creative or whatever, so that's what they look like. And right over here, we have ourselves the blazes. Oh, yeah, there we go. Look at me. Look at me. They look pretty nasty. They look mean. They look vicious. Yep, those are the blazes. <laughs> See you later, friends. And right here we have ourselves the Endermen. Hello, friend. And I know these guys aren't like the nether things, but they teleport everywhere, so I kind of put them over here. Anyway. <laughs> oh, no, I broke it. I need a button. I broke it. Let me go ahead and put that back. Let's go ahead and bring out another one there. So, yep, yeah, that's what they look like there. And then we have the pigment. Oh, that's a baby pigment. Let's bring out the other pigment. Ooh, look pretty vicious. Look at me. The baby ones is are a little bit different. They, you know, they don't have the the flesh uh, over the other part of the eye, um, like these guys do here. But those what are what the uh, pigment look like. Zombie pigment. See you later, friends. All right, guys. Now that we went ahead and took care of that, let's go ahead and look at what we look like with some gear on, right? And also this. So what I need to do here really quickly is switch this over to um, survival really quickly. We're going to go ahead and put on all of our gear. Did I not grab my sword? There we go. Uh, that's with our sword in hand. That's what that looks like. Right, and then we have it with the gear on. That's all the diamond gear on, looking pretty good. Let me go ahead and close that, and that's what the UI for that looks like. And also, let's go ahead and take a look at the XP, which looks exactly the same, I think. Uh, I can't really tell a difference. Let's see if we can get some more out of it. Come on. Why can't I see the little bubbles? Give me the little bubbles. Maybe if I throw it up there somewhere. There we go. Yep, they look about exactly the same, to be honest. And then we have uh, the armor, uh, the the health and uh, your food, your hunger, and all that good stuff, or your health, your hunger, and your armor. Goodness, if only I could speak. Um, so there we go, we have all that right down there. So let's go ahead and place that all here, and remove all of this, and place this all in here. Just like that, I'm gonna go ahead and switch it back over to creative. Um, there we go, we have it in creative now. So now we can go ahead and take a look at the different, um, well, we can go into the nether. So we have the nether portal here, uh, that's what it looks like with it activated with the obsidian all the way around just like that and let's go ahead and go to the other side and see what it's all about over here and what it looks like so we have our we have our wither boss hey friend hey hey so that's what it looks like right there let's see if we can get it to attack us see if we can see the actual little heads flying at us if it's possible hey, hey i'm over here I'm, I'm over here come follow me over here there it is. It's looking at So there we go. We can see the heads flying off there. So that is the wither. And then we have ourselves the wither skeleton. And we have a spawner right down there. But that is the wither skeletons right there as well. How you doing, friend? How you guys doing? You guys miss me? I bet you did. All right. Um, and then we have, of course, the lava. And this is what the nether would kind of look like, of course. Um, so there we go. This is the nether with the smooth, smoothic. Um, texture pack. So let's go ahead and go over to the other side and see the last last mob and place basically 
that we have to see. So before we jump in there, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the end portal. And that's what it looks like without any of the ender eyes inside of it. So that is the portal block right there. And then, of course, right over here, we have the portal block with the actual ender eye inside of it. And then we have the portal, which looks exactly the same. So what we're going to do, make sure there's nothing on me. And let's go ahead and jump over to the other side. Yes, now that we're over onto the other side, let's go ahead and take a look. Bam! Take a look at the fireworks, which doesn't look like it's been textured at all, to be honest. Um, so there we go. That is the fireworks. Now we got to look for... There it is. Let's go see if the dragon has been textured. Mm, th there it is. It, it looks like it has. Come on, let me look at your face. I want to see your eyes. Tell me you have the cool eyes that I like so much. You know? <laughs> Come back. Come back, dragon. Does it? Oh, it, oh no, it doesn't. But that is the dragon and what it looks like in this texture pack, guys. Remember that all the information for this is down below. So if you guys want to go download it and give it a try, um, and let me know what you guys think about this texture pack down below, that would be great. But I think I'm going to actually jump into a... Um, a, a city real quick to show you guys what it would look like if you were actually playing in a city and I'll be right back as soon as I get into that. What up guys and welcome to a city map that I actually downloaded. Um, I did not make this. I will have the information. I downloaded it. I will have the link down there if you guys want to go download it. But this is the Smoothic Texture Pack or Resource Pack, I should say, with shaders on. So if you guys play with shaders and you play with this Resource Pack and you were, you know, in a city or something, this is kind of what it would look like. So I wanted to give you guys a, a look at it if you actually were to play with it. Uh, so right now we're in a cemetery type area. You know what I'm saying? So this is what it would look like if you were to play with uh, with the texture pack with shaders as well, with the shaders mod. And all that information, of course, will be down below, like I always say, guys. So there we go. That's what it would look like if it, you were to build it and to play with it, which it looks really, really nice. At least I think so. Um, I, I like the way it all comes together. And, of course, the shaders mod uh, brings it out a little bit more. I don't know. I just really like the shaders mod as well. Uh, but that's what that looks like with the shaders mod. So let's go ahead and try to get through some of these little villages. I don't want to really do a, a tour of the city. I just wanted to show you what it would look like if we were to use this texture uh, pack with um, with a, um, with a the shaders mod and how the texture pack looks like if you were to play with it in an actual real world. Um, so there we go. Let me see if I can close that without. And so we have ourselves. Look at that. We got ourselves some villagers here, chilling, relaxing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Look at all cool. And then, of course, we have our... So that's what this texture pack would look like, guys, if you were to play with it in the world. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And if you do, remember to hit that like button. Uh, tell your friends about it. Share it. It helps the channel out so much, and I do appreciate it. Uh, each and every single one of you guys that do hit that like button and do share it and uh, stay for the content and hopefully you guys enjoy.